favorite movie of all time? I like that. Dude, let me do that. You want, you want it to be? Hi. Okay. Yeah. Hey, Richard. How, how are you? Don't, aren't you going to ask me who I am? What's your favorite movie of all time? Oh, please. Oh, hold on. All right, well, I'm, I just wrote these questions today. <laughs> What's your favorite Oscar moment? Mine. Getting one, right? Hey, uh, if you could ask Jesus one question, what would it be? Um, didn't you move that ball with your toe when no one, when you thought no one was looking? <laughs> uh, does Rick Santorum scare the hell out of you? Uh, no, he doesn't. Uh, the in, uh, no, no, the entire American political process scares the hell out of me. Do you think Congress is to blame to, for all the economic woes in this country? No, the American voter and taxpayer. Really? Why? Because they've swallowed a stupid argument that makes them think that paying taxes is some like added burden as opposed to citizenship. Let me ask you, I mean, personally, I mean, I'm, I'm really curious about this. How would you fix the economy? What's the answer for this turmoil? Teach civics. Teach how to run the country before it's your turn to run the country. And to teach it with realism and not with chatter. Teach the realistic wielding of political power to the very young so that they're not pickpocketed by every Tom, Dick, and Harry that walks by. Let me ask you, you know, the gas prices are skyrocketing. Who do you blame? Obama, Iran, Congress, the oil companies? Who do you blame? Or any of them? Probably the people who are making the profits from it. And who is the oil company? Oil industry, maybe. Has, has it ever occurred to anybody? When they asked the oil companies in the 70s, why are there are these lines at the gas stations? And they said, we don't know. Didn't it strike you as a little tinny? And... Why is it, since they've wrecked that industry, why do we take for granted that they're going to run the next energy industry? They're dumb. They've made us lose jobs. They've made us skyrocket in costs. Get rid of them. Go send them to jail, the ones that have broken the law. I agree. Yeah. I agree 100%. This is ridiculous what's happening. And the American people are just taking it on the chin. I mean, do you see it? The American people should concentrate more. We have to concentrate more on what our obligations are. And do you think we should care about uh, everybody else, like, you know, foreign countries, or just worry about ourselves? Because it seems like we give out all sorts of money to all these different... You can't separate them. They're all one thing. You're either connected to the world and live in it, or you're not. And if you've managed to convince a majority of people that it's okay for you to just take some reward and not pay any responsibility, then you've succeeded in your greedy little theft and you'll end up in hell. But the other side of that is thinking is something that requires effort and discipline and rigor and pleasure. Speaking of pleasure, how's your sex life? Unbelievable. <laughs> and I mean that in every possible way. <laughs>